Hi everybody, welcome in. I hope you're doing amazing today. It's so great to see you. Today we are going to be doing a Animal Crossing Wild World cozy playthrough. Um, you may be new here or you may not be and if you're not you may remember my Animal Crossing New Horizons cozy 5am gameplays. This video is going to be kind of like that but it's going to be at 10pm instead because I really enjoy the 10pm music in Wild World so I thought that would be nice. We're just kind of going to do like villager tasks, um, do some fishing, maybe catch some bugs and I can show you around my town. This gameplay is pretty new. Um, I started it today. <laughs> I've only played it for a few hours. Um, so we don't have that many villagers or that many tools. So maybe we can work towards um, getting more villagers and getting more tools so that we can do more things like pop balloons and get fossils that would be really really good um so yes as you can see we have tangy which was actually shocking because we got tangy as one of our first free villagers um so that was very cool <laughs> um but yeah let's get started shall we so yes 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 let me get situated here i did i did come to play um i think we, I think I'm going to change the date because I think we may possibly be like really far into the future. Oh no, we're not far into the future, we're far into the past. Because um, today is the 28th of May. So I think I'm going to make it, I think I'll make it the 1st of June. Just so that we've had a couple more villagers move in. And also so that... Um, Yes, <laughs> so that, yes, change it to 10 p.m. I think the shops are actually open until 11 p.m. in Wild World. I could be wrong though, but we will see. That's nothing there, thank you. Thank you very much. Do you like my outfit? I really enjoy that. <laughs> my outfit is like matching like the hat is yellow the glasses are green and then the top is green and yellow it was totally accidental i swear it's a complete accident my island or town is called satori i don't know i always call my towns and islands satori my first animal crossing new horizons town was also called satori as well oh no my flowers are like dead oh what's this It's the flea market! Oh my god, this is great! I'm gonna sell bugs and fish because in Wild World they have like a flea market and you can sell your bugs and fish for double the price of what Tom would pay for them. Oh no! These are red turnips. We don't have these in New Horizons but you have them in Wild World and you get them from Joan who sells the turnips in this one who is Daisy May's grandma. I think she's her grandma. Please correct me if I'm wrong. I'm pretty sure it's her grandma though. Maybe her auntie, I'm not sure. Um, and she gives you red turnips in this one and you can grow the turnips yourself. Um, you have to water them every single day though. I just time traveled, so I obviously didn't do that, but that's okay. I'm also very unsure on what, um, <laughs> what works as water in here. Like, do you think this counts as water in? I don't know if that's landed on the flower. We'll see. So when the flowers start dying in this game, you can just water them and they'll come back to life, which is cool. Let's say hi to Tangi. Emmy, is that you? Why are you doing up this late? Something fun, I hope. I ate peach crumble all day and then I decided to shop for cloves, but it didn't help. I was just so lonely until you showed up. Oh, oh, so did you want something from me or what? I'm killing time. You know, I don't think I'm ever going to be a star in this town. So someday, I might just move to another town and start a new career there. Oh no, Emmy, don't look at me like that. But if it ever happens, you should talk to Copper and Booker. Is it Booker, do you think? Copper and Booker, yeah, because it's they're based on cops, right? And you like, is this like a thing? Like you book someone? I don't know. 
Then you can come visit me in my new town anytime you want. Yay! Oh, that's interesting. I don't remember this. So in Wild World, when your villagers move away, you must be still you must still be able to go and visit them, which is pretty cool. I do apologise. I'm probably going to keep accidentally pressing the wrong button, um, but hopefully not. <laughs> hopefully I won't keep doing that. Okay, we got to pick up the weeds because if the weeds get out of hand in this game, they're impossible to clean up. Even more so than Wild World, uh, in the New Horizons. Okay, so this is a new house. Should we just go in and see the surprise? Because I don't know who this is, but this is definitely a new home. Let's go and see who it is. Oh my god, it's Mo! No way! Good evening, it's almost time for supper. My belly clock is always on time, so I always know when it's time to eat. I named my belly clock after myself. It's it's the Mo Quartz. Wow, thanks Mo. <laughs> the dialogue in this game is so funny. Also, is he wearing like a tuxedo? That's so cute. Okay, let me go to the shop. Nan's up here as well. Let's say hi to Nan. Oh, hi, Amy. Can you believe it's already 22 o'clock? I wish you'd stop by a little earlier so we'd have more time to talk. I'm sure you had a lot of things to do today. I'm sorry for being a crybaby. Oh no, Nan! Anyways, did you need something, kid? I'm killing time. I was just over at the museum checking out the collection, you know? Is it just me? Or is the whole atmosphere over there just kind of... sombre? It's usually so exciting. I wonder what's been throwing off the vibe, kid. You know what, Nan? I feel like it's probably Blavers, because Blavers is a bit questionable in this game. I don't know why, but I don't really like him in this game. He kind of scares me. <laughs> Yo, I think this is the first time we've talked, right? I'm Gaston. I like to dig up fossils. Hey, you and I should have a competition someday. Thanks. Maybe one day. Okay, um, I wanted to go to the shop. Which is here? Is it open? They are! They're open until 11pm. 11, 11 I feel like they close way earlier in the recent games. So that's nice. Oh, there's a shovel! Great. I don't have a shovel yet, so we should get that. Oh, I can't afford it. <laughs> Obviously. I can't afford it. Um, okay, let's leave. We'll come back. We may as well sell the stuff in the flea market, right? Because we've got fish, so hopefully they'll buy the fish. And they buy them for uh, double the price that Tom buys them for. So let's see. We'll look at the map after as well because I feel like someone else has probably moved in. Now we just stand here and wait patiently for someone to arrive. <laughs> I'll skip this ahead for you. Someone's here! Gaston. Yo, it's me, Gaston. You know me, Monchao. Hi, Gaston. Do you want anything? Whoa, check it out! Emmy, I approve of this room's manly aroma! <laughs> yeah? Okay. Sure. This is what a man's room looks like. It's just full of bugs and fish. That's so nice. Hey, this room is practically empty. Oh, do you not want to buy my bug and fish? I thought that he would want to buy them. I read online that they do. Wow, I gotta say, your yellow butterfly is kind of nice. How much do you want for it? Okay, let's see. So how much does a yellow butterfly sell for usually? Let me just quickly grab this information. Okay, so in Wild World, this sells for 90 bells, so we might be able to get 200 bells for it. Are you serious? You can't scam me. I know you. Okay. <laughs> Come on, Emmy. <laughs> okay, fine. Maybe like 180? Are you serious? Oh. Okay, well maybe 150 then. <laughs> He's like, please.
please don't do this to me. You're so evil. <laughs> right on. I'll take it. Okay. I mean, that's better than the... Um, than the 90 that Tom would have given us, so. Okay, do you want anything else? Are you like looking at something or? Whoa there, look at that red snapper. <laughs> I've always wanted one. How much will you sell it for? Okay, let's see. I'll just try. Surely the red snapper sells for quite a bit. It looks, um, looks cranny. Okay, so the red snapper sells for 3,000 bells. So we'll try 6,000. He might say no. That would be wild if he said yes to six grand. I have a feeling he'll say no. Oh, what? He's buying it for six grand? No way. That's so much money. Here you go, take it. Damn. Wait, I feel like... I feel like we should go and do some more fishing. Yeah, I'm going. What? Why are you doing this? You gotta go... You got something better to do? Oh, fine. If you're leaving, I guess I'll go too. Oh my god, they're so, like, angry in this game. <laughs> All right, let's go and do more fishing because it seems like the fish are selling for quite a bit of money. So if we go and do some fishing and then try and sell it, we could get quite a good amount of money. We might even be able to pay off our first debt because I've not even done that yet. So that would be really fun. Let's see. Oh, look at all the flowers dying. This is so sad to keep watering them. There should be a beach down here somewhere. I guess it doesn't need to be um, fish though, right? Like, well, no, it does need to be fish, but it doesn't need to be um, sea fish, ocean fish. Oh, also, I should see how much those uh, turnips are going to sell for too. No, don't be sad. <laughs> the sad face is so funny. Oh, I'm so going to get bit by that mosquito. Oh no, it's circling around me. Yep. I got bit by a mosquito. So very itchy. So sad. I feel like it's really hard to fish in this game. Um, I struggle really badly in this one. Oh, it's another red snapper. That's another six grand. No way. That's so exciting. So in this game, maybe if you've not played it before, the flea market happens, I think, every first Saturday of the month. Which is really cool, right? Because it sells... Oh, I don't know. I think that was a river fish. It can't cross over to the ocean. I might be wrong. Um, so yeah, a flea... I wish they had the flea market in New Horizons. It would be so fun to be able to actually sell your villagers things instead of just giving them stuff from the outside. I think it's such a nice little, um, like, feature of the game. Pick up these weeds. Let's try and get this one. That was probably way too far away. Wait, he's swimming up there, so maybe not. The graphics have changed so much. <laughs> like, it's so funny. The water looks so silly. Is that a catfish? <gasps> no way. 
I feel like, do you think the catfish is rare? Why does it look like it would be rare? Whoa, is that a firefly? Did you see that in the corner of the screen? Whoa, hold on. We gotta go this way. Can I catch that? Is it going away? Oh my god. Let me see if I can catch it. <laughs> That's definitely not right. Maybe over here. I wonder if they're catchable. They must be. <gasps> Whoa, I got it. The gentle light. It relaxes me. Okay, we're not going to give this one away. We should probably put the, the uh, firefly in the museum. My pockets are full now as well, so let's try and sell these fish. I have to be quick before someone enters the house. Because they might just like randomly enter. So let me see. We're gonna put the red snapper down. That's another 6,000. Which is really, really exciting. Um, let me move this. We'll get the catfish down too. Alright. And now we wait again. I will look at how much these things- Oh, there's someone here already. Nan, anyone home? It's Nan. Emmy, are you here? Hi, Nan. Wow, look at all this stuff. You have impeccable taste. There's no doubt about it. Thank you so much, Nan. Okay, Emmy, it's time for me to get my shop on. Alright, I'll stand here and wait. She's going straight for the butterfly. Oh, Emmy. Hey, I have a question about your tiger butterfly. How much do you want for it, kid? Hmm. Okay, let's see. So the tiger butterfly sells for 160 um, with nooks. So we'll sell it for 250. What? For that piece of junk? Are you crazy? Huh? What is she talking about? Okay then. <laughs> um, 200? Great. If that's the price you're selling it for, sign me up. It's a deal. It's a deal. I'll take your tiger butterfly for... How many bells again? Oh yeah, 200. And don't worry, I'll take good care of it. Okay, you want... Surely you, well, you want the catfish? You want an- oh, is this the yellow butterfly? Oh, Emmy, hey, I have a question about your yellow butterfly. How much do you want for it? Um, how much did we just sell it for? I don't remember. I'm gonna say 200. I think that was too much, right? What? For that piece of junk? She's so mean. Why is she insulting my butterfly? How rude. Okay, 150. Oh, that's 1,000. <laughs> Probably would make her leave very angrily. Great, if that's the price you're selling for, sign me up. We have a deal then. I'll just be taking your yellow butterfly. Okay, do you want to buy any of the fish? You want another tiger butterfly? So uh, how much are you asking for your- <laughs> you want another one? Okay. Um, 200? <laughs> 200? That sounds good. Are you sure about the price? Yeah. It's fine, I guess. <laughs> the deal, I'll take your tiger butterfly for- how many bells again? Oh yeah, 200. And don't worry. Thanks, Nan. Please, buy the fish. The fish. Nan, look at this. It's a red snapper. Isn't it so nice? And this, I got a catfish over here. Interesting, Emmy. You know, this is the last thing I'd expected to see at your house. <laughs> yeah, well, you know. <laughs> what can I say? I'm an incredible interior designer, decorator person. Nan, obviously. It's so beautiful in here. 
I love how dark and dingy it is as well. There's like no lighting in here. It's just fish and bugs. I don't think she wants to buy anything else, but I'm not sure she knows how to leave on her own. Because she's not really moved or done anything. Maybe I'm impatient. It just feels like she's broken, maybe. <laughs> okay, no. I'm gonna leave. Um, excuse me, Emmy. Where are you going? Why are you going somewhere? Oh, well, then I'll get going too. Okay, bye. We can also go to villagers' homes and get, like, stuff from their homes that they're selling, which is very exciting. Um, let me check our map and see who else moved in. Was it just... Oh, okay, it was just Mo. Okay. Um, I'm gonna go inside one more time. Oh, well, actually, let's go to someone else's house and see if we can... <gasps> Oh my god, it's a dandelion! Oh my god! I, oh my god, I'm so excited about this! Okay, wait. Are you ready? This is so fun. Look at what you can do with the dandelions! How cute is that? It's so cute! Such a cute detail. My Animal Crossing New Horizons island is called Dandelion. It's a nostalgia island. I so wish that we had dandelions like that so that I could have them all over my island. I think it would be so cute. Such a shame they got rid of them because they were in New Leaf as well. They just ended up getting rid of them though, which is very sad. Why will it not let me pick up this weed? There we go. Oh, look at Teddy, he's looking at the firefly. See what he has to say. Hey, evening. How's it going, Groof? I hear getting big air is all the rage now. Me. I'm just getting... I'm just into getting big. <laughs> so yeah, Groof. What did you need? I'm bored. Hey, let me ask you. Do you know how to build a weird looking physique? Show me. Well, I'm not going to show you. But let me tell you. You've got to do three sets of 100 push-ups, 100 curls, 100 skull crushes, and three squats every day. You'll be top heavy in no time. <laughs> Thanks for the workout tips, Teddy. I'm just not entirely sure I'm going to be following those, but I appreciate it anyways. <laughs> okay, I think this is Pearl's house. Let's see what she's selling. Hi, Pearl. I was hoping you'd pop in. Okay. La 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 la. Isn't my house just too awesome for words? If there's something you like, you have to tell me, okay? <laughs> just looking! <laughs> okay. Ha. Huh. You're such a child. What? <laughs> what does she mean by that? <laughs> okay. Which piece are you referring to? I kind of really like this. This red chair and this plant, I would like to take. You really shouldn't go buying something for cheap at someone person's house and selling it for a profit at your own place. It's just plain old tacky. I didn't do that. Don't you find the red armchair lovely? Just like me? Yeah, I want it. Can I have it? <laughs> Pool. Hmm. Some nice taste you got. Wow. The red armchair is one of my favourites right now. Well, that must mean she's not selling it. I'd be willing to sell my corn plant to you. Okay. Deal. Well then, my corn plant is all yours. Thank you. That's it. Can you hear the bird? It's like alive. It's, it's tweeting and stuff. Scary because there's actual bird villagers in the game. I don't think there's a bird cage in the newer games, right? From what I remember. Okay. Who else is around and out? Well, not out, but inside the home. Let me look at the map again. Who have we got? No one's house is over here, but we've got Nan up here. This is... Uh, whose home is this? Moe's home. He's in boxes, so we can't go and shop there. Gaston's not in. Tangy might be in. Teddy's not in. 
Okay, so we'll go back this way. And we'll see if Tangy's in. And if not, then we'll go back into our house and try and sell that catfish and red snapper. I'll pick up the bugs out of the house so they don't want to buy them anymore. And I'll just sell them normally because they don't really sell for that much more. The fish, though, they sell for quite a lot, so... Okay, these none of these people are in. So let's go back. Okay, quickly pick up these stuff. Oh my gosh, I'm pressing oh I can't. Damn. My inventory's full. Okay. We patiently wait in our dingy dark room full of bugs and fish and hopefully we can sell the red snapper and the catfish someone's here it's tangy oh my god that is great news hi tangy oh the catfish only sells for 800 bells that's not much woohoo i totally scored did you hear me I said woohoo 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 <laughs> I'm afraid <laughs> for finding hot loot at low prices. It gets out of control sometimes. Okay, Tangy. <gasps> Are you going for the red snapper? Is this the catfish that you would like? Wouldn't your cute catfish look perfect in my place? Um yeah, obviously. I'll sell it to you. Okay, let's see how much we should sell it for. So Maybe 1,600. I think it sells for 800. Okay, I'll take it for that price. Let me see if I can get it up anymore. Oh no! I think I just made it so she's not selling it and so she won't buy it anymore. Oh my god, I wasn't calling you annoying, Tangy. <laughs> She's a black belt, my bad. Oh, well, she's going for the red snapper, so that's good. Wouldn't your cute red snapper look perfect at my place? You'll sell it to me, right, Emmy? Totally. 6,000. Okay, I'll take it for that price. It's all yours. Look how much money we made. We have 12,000 now. Woohoo! Red snapper, meet your new owner. This is going so well that I'm, it's kind of freaking me out. Okay, she wants the catfish again. Ah, this must be the this season's hottest new catfish. But I'm so broke. Don't have a don't you have a family and friends discount? Let's chat. Okay. After she sent spent that six grand, she's like, I don't have any more money. But hopefully, she still buys it for this. Okay, I'll take it for that price. Okay, good. Thre 13,000. We're nearly at 14,000. We literally are so close to paying off our debt. The debt's like 14,800. Wouldn't your cute common butterfly look perfect at my place? Yeah, okay. I don't know how much, I'm just gonna say 200, no, because it's common butterfly, it's probably not that much, 100 will be fine. Okay. Okay, so yes. <laughs> the dialogue's so good. Okay, do you want the last butterfly? I feel like they can only buy free things and then they get kind of like stuck and they don't leave for some reason. What? Emmy, are you going out? Um, okay, I'll just go sniff. <laughs> Bye for now. Bye, Tangy. Let's go to the Able Sisters. We need to speak to, uh, May... No. Is it Sable? That's at the counter, I forgot. We need to go on a weed thing and try and get rid of all the weeds. Hey, welcome, welcome to the Able Sisters where you are the fashion designer. Thank you. Whoa, this top is so nice. Maybe it's time to get rid of our combo here and dress in something cute instead. 
Oh yes, you're looking at the beaded shirt. Can I try it on? Oh, that's really cute. I'll buy it. Oh, my pockets are full. You're so right. I'm sorry. Hmm. Okay. I'll have to drop the stuff outside my house because the problem is, is that if I get my, like, dresser out again <laughs> and then try and fill it with items, there's no way someone else is going to end up walking into the house. So for now, I'll just drop some stuff in my garden. No, I just killed the flower. Oh no. I'll just drop some of this on the floor and then we can pick it up and clean it up after. Okay. Hi, I'm back. What's her name? This must be Sable, right? Hmm, your name is Emmy, isn't it? Hey, what gives, sis? You almost never remember a customer's name. Don't say things you don't need to, Mabel. Do feel free to take a look around and don't mind us. Oh, thanks. Okay, let's get this. This is so cute. I'll buy it. Thank you. Let's put it on. Is it this one? No, this one. Should we change our glasses too? We should definitely take the hat off. Okay, the green glasses or the yellow glasses? Hmm. Green's my favorite color, so we gotta go with the green. <laughs> okay. Now let's go to Tom's and see how much he's buying turnips for. I bought these turnips off of Joan for a um, hundred. For one hundred, I think. Welcome, welcome. Please feel free to take a look around. Okay, thank you. Yes, yes, what can I do for you? I want to sell- oh no, turnip prices, my bad. Well, I can still sell these shells here. Let's see. All together, 210. We have a deal. Thank you so much. Turnip prices. I'm currently buying turnips for 53 bells per turnip. No. Sorry, Tom, but that is a scam. <laughs> Absolutely not. Okay. Mm, what did I say we were going to do? I forgot. <laughs> Excuse me, Gaston. Thank you. Oh, did I get- that's what I was saying. Did I get the shovel? No. I did not get the shovel. Oh, because I was too poor, I remember. Let's get it. Here we go. Why, yes, that would be a shovel. It sells for 500 bells. I'll buy it. Thank you. <laughs> He's like, thank you so much. <laughs> All right. He's telling us how to use the shovel. I don't need this information. I already know. <laughs> okay, let me see what this wallpaper and stuff looks like too. Shanty wall, show me. No, I hate that so bad. I like the big cobweb in the corner of the room. So nice. Okay, let me see. That's not too bad. Hmm, but no. I don't like it. But it's not bad, you know. Should we send some people some letters too? The bubble paper. Okay, I say yes. Perfect, thank you. Okay, so my plan is to write some letters and then possibly send them and also we should check the recycling box and go to the lost and found as well to see if there's anything there. We've missed some stuff here, so it's the flea market. Okay, that's it. It's Pearl's birthday. 
The flea market is open for business tomorrow. Visit other thloxes and pick up gently used items for dirt cheap. Okay, let's write a letter. We should write a letter to... Whoa, what just happened? <laughs> Why did it just glitch? That was very scary. Um, write a letter to Nan. I like Nan. Dear Nan, I like you. <laughs> You're nice. <laughs> Do a little smiley face and a heart. Confirm. Dear Nan, I like you. You're nice. From Emmy. Oh look, when it said bubble, I didn't think that it would be like like bubble wrap. I thought it would be like actual bubbles, but it's bubble wrap. That's so cute. Yes. Okay. Let's go and send this and we'll pay off our a bit of our mortgage. Send the letter. And check the recycling box. Oh, it's Phyllis! <laughs> Ugh, a customer. This is the town post office. What do you need? Mail a letter. Fine. I'll take your mail. Just give it to me already. <laughs> So, anything else? Got any other letters? Nope. That's what I suspected. I guess we're done talking. Stop joking, my G. We're actually not done, sorry. Ugh, a customer. Pay mortgage. I got it, I got it. A deposit for Nux, right? You're still paying? <laughs> okay, your remaining balance is 18,000. No, it's not. Is it 18,000? I don't know why I thought it was 14,000. I was incorrect. I will just do 10,000 then. Oh, but your remaining bell balance is 8,400. Anyway, the deposit's done. That means you can go. It's about time too. What was it? Hurry up already. Uh, never mind. Fine. Don't let the door hit your tail on the way out. <laughs> She's so mean. Oh, there's nothing in the recycling box. That's so sad. Off to the... I don't really know what this would be. The gates, I guess, right? I think it's the gates. Oh look, there's a clover here. Oh, wrong button again. <laughs> Not a four leaf clover, so sad. Do they exist in this game? I presume they do if they have clovers, because the four leaf clovers exist in new leaf. Hmm, well. Oh, uh, what can I do for you? Something lost? Um, we currently have some items in the lost and found. I mean, we definitely have three, I think. Oh, a top. This is cool. A dragon suit. Whoa. A pitfall seed and some composer paper. Okay. You've uh, claimed quite a few items there. It's fine. Not a problem, I think. <laughs> Okay, he's like, oh, uh, am I supposed to be doing something about this? Hmm, okay, let me see. We should probably drop this on the floor for now. What does the dragon suit look like? Whoa, that's so cool. <laughs> but no, it is cool. But I like my beaded shirt. My beaded shirt's very sweet. I'm going to try and be really quick about this. I'm going to take this and hopefully we can get everything in here before someone tries to walk into the house. So let's put this on the floor. 
real quick and then here we go so we already have some stuff in here i'm like collecting cloves apparently <laughs> i'm a hoarder so i'm gonna put all this in here and what's in the next one i think that's empty here we have furniture in this one we have wallpapers and then this was like miscellaneous so like paper and then we'll obviously keep our tools here we just need an axe now i think that's the last tool and we'll go and put this in there as well Oh yeah, we got the plant. We should actually put this down. We'll have to wait until the flea market's over. I think we could probably go and donate um, some of this stuff that we've got, like the firefly and the butterfly in the corner. We can go and give that to Blathers, I think. Music's so nice. Oh, the museum's here. I don't know what I was doing. <laughs> I was clearly distracted by the music. He's wide awake. Hmm. Oh no. He's gonna say something really weird. I was playing the game the other day and I spoke to him and he said something really, really like <laughs> low key ableist. It's really weird. Ah, yes, well. I believe I'd mentioned before that since opening the cafe, we've seen an increase in the number of rather odd customers at the museum. Yes, well, I believe we saw one of the more extreme cases the other day. Enough already. I'm sorry, Blavos. Ah, I'm terribly sorry. I fear I might have said a wee bit too much. You unfortunately did, bestie. <laughs> I'm so sorry if that upset anyone, but I... The dialogue sometimes is really questionable and I didn't want to have to go through it again. Um, ah, oh, who indeed, who do you? It's always a treat to have visitors here. Welcome to the Satori Museum. Do enjoy yourself. So by the by, might there be something with which I can assist you? A donation, please? One can only feverishly wonder what, what you wish to donate. I will donate to you the firefly first, I think. Ooh, ah, what we have here? A firefly? If not, I'm not utterly mistaken. Ah, no, please, don't bother taking it out of its cage. Protocols, you know. <laughs> I'm a bit squeamish about insects, you see, and I don't fancy touching one. I've heard tales of children unable to buy candles. Yes, these unfortunate souls are said to have uh, studied by f firefly light. Ugh, the mere thought of having a bug that close. <laughs> I'd rather read in darkness. <laughs> of course you would. Okay, yes, let's try and donate this um, butterfly as well. Ah, who? Hmm, indeed. I say, but we've already received a common butterfly. Oh, I didn't realise. My bad. This is rather humorous, actually, Emmy. You are the donor. Yes, sadly, it means I must return this one. No, keep its cage shut. If you must let it go, do it outside. <laughs> okay, so there might be anything else. No, that's good. Alright, and whilst we're here then, let's get a coffee, shall we? Hello, oh my god, yes, it's a Saturday, of course. KK Sliders is here. Hey, what a groovy night. Always glad to see new faces making the scene. My name is KK Slider. I play my tunes here pretty much every Saturday night. And what do they call you, Emmy? Cool. Care for a song? Oh yeah. Cool. 
Hey, if there's something you want to hear, just give it to me straight. I'm taking requests if you're giving them. Ooh, yeah. Far out, man, far out. What do you want to hear? This is so funny because I remember... <laughs> I remember requesting, like, um, Umbrella by Rihanna all the time. And I would get so mad when he didn't play it because I was like, why is he not playing Umbrella by Rihanna? Like, this makes no sense to me right now. <laughs> I requested it. Why is he not playing it? Obviously, because he's not requesting random songs. Okay, I wonder if I can request like an like any KK slider song. So I'm gonna go for KK Bossa, but let's see if I can get this. So it would like I'll try and request it exactly how it's written. So K K B O S S A. Mellow, I can dig that. I'm all set to play, so cop a seat, man. Okay. Oh, can I sit here? This is far out. Get ready to groove to KK Vosa. <laughs> this is so cute. With the credits and stuff, I'll let you listen. <laughs> I look so cute, oh my god. I feel like we need to talk about the fact that he didn't even play the song I requested though. I wonder how he starts, like how do you get him to play the songs? I also really hope this is not going to end up getting like... Um, <laughs> copyrighted, am I going to get a copyright claim from Nintendo? Hopefully not. That light in the corner looks like a whole galaxy or something, like a star. That was beautiful. Thank you so much for singing that, KK. Stunning tune. <laughs> wow. <laughs> that was great. Thank you. The lights come back on. Don't throw me that look, man. I know that's the wrong riff. Oh, okay. The thing is, KK Bruce is not on my set list, man. So I was just pulling your leg. I didn't mean to put you on. Drop by next week, man. Okay, well, maybe the song didn't exist at this point. I don't know. The coffee may seem a tad expensive at 200 bells. A cup, but it's well worth it. One, please. Thanks. All right then, before it gets cold, one fresh brewed cup, enjoy. Thanks. <laughs> Today's blend, boasts of mild flavor. It's quite drinkable for those with unrefined palates. Wow. Do you like, that cake in the corner looks so good. I would like that cake. Thanks. You're welcome. Thanks, Brewster. Bye, KK Slider. Thanks for not playing the song I requested. Just like the good old days. Appreciate that. <laughs> okay. 
let's see if anyone else is in their house. Um, I have a feeling that nobody's gonna be in their homes. I don't think it will have changed, but we'll see. We do have a shovel now. So let me do some digging. A fossil. Let's keep an eye out. There's one over here too. Oh, hi Teddy. Oh no. Yo, what is up? It's Lil E. Yeah, he decided that my name was going to be Lily. <laughs> I feel like a million bells today, and that's why I'm giving you this awesome kitty carpet. Whoa, whoops. Looks like I dropped it somewhere on the way here. Sorry, totally weak, I know, but just forget I said anything. What? I was so excited about that. That's so mean. Is it because my pockets are full? My pockets aren't full. Oh my god, he really did just lie to me. I was so excited about that because it would have matched our um, wardrobe. <laughs> he's so mean. All he's done is bully me. He's actually bullied me so bad. Maybe we can find it. Do you think he, when he says like he's dropped it somewhere, he's like actually dropped it and it's just like hanging around somewhere? Maybe not, right? Here's another one. Oh, we got our first gyroid. Oh, this is so cool. I'm excited to see. Oh, this is because it rained. I should probably dig this up too. Yeah, that's so sad. Move this flower over here. Okay, I want to see what this gyroid looks like. so cute <laughs> he's scary I like him <laughs> all right I think we'll go and get these fossils examined and then I think that's probably it for today. Oh, there's another one here. Oh, I think I may have just glitched. <laughs> oh, it's another gyroid. Oh no, Tangy! <gasps> I mean, why would she try and get my attention as soon as I'm walking through the door? Has she forgotten? Oh, she so has. No, that's so sad. Oh no, okay, okay. <laughs> oh, like, hi there. How's life, Emmy? You're one of my bestest friends in the world, but we have a boring greeting. I mean, snore. Come on, we should say something sassy and cute, just like me. Hey, you're really smart. Why don't you come up with something? Okay. Okay, what should we get her to call me? I like Buttercup, I think that's cute. Buttercup? Hmm, do you like it? Yeah. 
What's it got? Hey, yeah, that sounds so totally amazing. Okay, I'm gonna use this next time. Emmy, you're the best. I'm glad we're friends. Aww, she's so sweet. <laughs> What's wrong? Yes, oh well. I believe I'd mentioned before that since opening the cafe, we've seen an increase- No, I don't want to know what you've got to say about this. No, enough. Oh, is that so? Yeah, blab it, stop. Oh, back again, are we? So by the by, yes, so I would like to check these fossils. Have to do them all individually though, which is kind of sad. This one, please. Ah, hmm, yes, who indeed. Hmm, fascinating. Oh my. This delightful fossil is a T Rex torso. Yeah, that's so cool. Yes, you can actually have it. A T Rex torso, that's really cool. Take it. Oh then, if you insist, your donation is well and truly appreciated. I hope so. It would be cool. Imagine if all of the fossils we have here are from a T-Rex. That would be really cool. Ah, hmm, yes. <laughs> this delightful fossil is a parasaur torso. No, you can take it, Blavers. Do not worry. <laughs> to be blunt, it is a thing that has not yet been donated to the museum. Indeed, I would like your permission to keep it. You can keep it. You can have it. Take it. Who then, if you insist, your donation is well and truly appreciated. Wouldn't it be marvellous if the other parts were found? I'm rather a Twitter at the thought of this creature <laughs> in its completed form. Yeah, one more. Ah, hmm, yes. <laughs> hmm, fascinating. This delightful fossil is a dinosaur track. Oh, cool. No, you can have it. Yes. Who then, if you insist. Okay, before we go, let's have a little look at if we can see the... Oh, it's a T-Rex. Unlike with bones, we can see the foot's shape, skin texture and more. Why, we can even deduce how fast it ran. Hardly just any old footprint. Hmm. I'm frightfully sorry. The thought of such mighty feet. <laughs> it leads me to no end. Okay. No, that's it. Oh, it's 11pm now. Okay, thanks, Blavers. Let me see in here. Whoa, this must be the T-Rex. T-Rex. Just that's that's all it says. Just T-Rex. <laughs> okay, everyone. Thank you so much for watching today's video. I hope you enjoyed. Um, and yeah, it was... Oh, <laughs> is he asleep or is he sad? I don't know. Okay, it's been super fun filming this and I appreciate you hanging out with me today. Um, I hope you have a wonderful rest of your day, whatever you do. Um, and wherever you are and yes hopefully I'll see you next time thank you so much and take care of yourself bye bye